Hi guys, we're back at Drayton Manor today for the opening of Gold Rush. It's just turned half ten. We've gone in through the engines back there in the Thomas Land and the ride opens at half twelve. So we're just gonna walk around, maybe get a drink and stuff, and then hopefully we can join the key for Gold Rush, but we're open for another two hours. But yeah, exciting stuff. Here's a new area, Frontier Falls. We'll head over this way. This is all new gravel on the ground, it looks great. I still think the green doesn't really go with that. Oh, new accelerator logo, that's great. I accelerate to the future. But yeah, the green's a bit odd, I think. We'll head over. These buildings look great, we've seen these before. It's at the front there. There's a new shop. Undertaker the last souvenir shop, and there's people on Gold Rush. What? I thought it wasn't open until half twelve. Well, we thought it was open at half twelve, but it's been flooded, so yeah. That's a bit interesting. Here we are, this entrance, the door rush. Yeah. Let's go, come on! We've got a big queue on there already, come on, Zach. I thought it was meant to be open at half twelve. Lovely for you, man. Oh, look at that, that's oh, massive. It is, very nice. And there's two settings to this ride, apparently. Just two different things. Oh, it looks great. Entrance, let's go. So just reach the back of the queue, which is here. Right. Oh, yeah, we don't mind waiting. Thing. Let's go. Whoa, something's happening in there. We're in the queue, been waiting about 22 minutes so far. I just want to show. Can I see a fucker looks like there? Gentlemen, this is a queue line announcement. When boarding the train, please remove all loose articles. Shop, get some generic merch. Some other ones like that. I need a little shop. Random store, big teddy bear. I like this up there, Harry. Oh, very nice. So we have just experienced our first ride on Gold Rush. So it's pretty good. We try, we uh, were on the setting where you go up the lift hill and you go all the way over first, go into the, the building over there and then shoot backwards and then you end up backwards up the lift hill and then you do the layout forwards again. Uh, the other setting is where you go straight up the lift hill and then you go backwards straight away. Uh, but yeah, we need to come back and try that one in a bit. But what do you think? Was it all right? It was, it was pretty good. Definitely, Definitely a family, family yeah, orientated. Definitely a family coaster. Not very thrilling, but the backwards sections are pretty good. And I would like to try the other setting later. But yeah, great addition to the park, especially because they're going towards this family friendly um, theme park. It's obviously Apocalypse used to be here, and I do miss Apocalypse. It was great. Uh, but for their target audience, nah, they're, going for, <laughs> they're going for this target audience now for the younger kids. It does make sense to have something like this because it is Me good, it is like modern, it's great. Yeah, great piece of interview right there. But yeah, hopefully we'll have another ride in it later, try the next setting. Uh, we might go around, do a few other rides just while we're here, and then yeah, come back to Goldbridge later. But too far, uh, I'd probably give it six out of 10, seven out of 10. Here we go, we're gonna head into Sure Shooting On. Harry likes some shooting dart rides. It's got a little bit of a cute, but we'll wait for it. I just realised that's our second gold rush we've done this year, or in fact this month, because we've gone at Sly Karen. My vlog is already out, so go check that out. And that'll just be up soon, but yeah. 
screwed on. Look at him shooting away, and the scores are even showing, and mine's showing the old one. I hurt the car that was on before us. Look at him go. Why is it saying that? That's zero. You're rubbish. <laughs> Try and get a bonus. Oh, there we go. Come on. Stop working. Oh, we got the car that doesn't work. It doesn't even say we got a bonus. That's such a fail. Oh, that seems to be worse. Such a fail. We keep getting bonuses. I've been noticing this. A lot of effects are working. Like every animatronic. Come on, you got a bonus. I got, I got a bonus. Because we had to we had to read it off the screen because it didn't actually show on the front of our car. But yeah, all right, right. At least all the effects were working in there. Just our car wasn't. So just by the wave, and I don't actually think it's open. It's nearly twelve o'clock. It's open. I've actually seen it go round today, so that's interesting. Um, but yeah, we might have gone the wraps are there open. So fun. <laughs> it's time to adventure curve river rapids because the wave's not open. Oh. Lovely soundtrack this one, and I don't know how long the queue is, we'll go have a look. But yeah, it's a good rapids ride, anyways. Not as good as the Belvoirde rapids we've just done. But, oh, looks like there's no queue. But this is the worst part, getting around these. <laughs> there we go. And there's more! <laughs> Oh, oh, oh. We've just done a bench curve River Rapids. My bag is soaked because it's on the seat next to me. Uh, but yeah, good ride. Didn't actually get that wet. It got a bit of a splash. Uh, but the, the effects at the end where they spray over were not on, luckily. So it didn't get that wet. But I enjoyed that. It's an alright Rapids ride. Uh, not one of the best out there. But yeah, decent theming throughout. Right, we've just eaten. We had some uh, garlic pizza bread from a. Uh, sorry, garlic bread. Whoa! From the pizza bus place. Got a drink, but nearly drank it. And we're gonna go have a look at the queue. We're we'll going rush again because it is a good coaster. We do want to try the other set in, hopefully. So we'll head through this way. Good theming. Yeah, posters everywhere. And you actually go up the hill a little bit here. Or going out and joining the cattle pit queue. Let's have a look. another go on Goldbush, we only waited about 20 minutes that time so not too bad at all but we had exactly the same cycle as last time so yeah we need another go because we need to get that cycle where you go up the lift hill and then go backwards straight away but they said on on um, instagram that they're going to change on to cycle two at one o'clock 
but we've seen them cycling over both all day anyway so it seems like the you're more likely to get the one that goes over the lift hill first than going backwards um first but yeah we got the same one twice unfortunately so we need another go maybe we'll have another go if the queue's still short Absolutely at some point let's look at some of them bit of gold there Gold there, some crusted around on the floor. Pretty good. It's funny like that, the, there's gold in gold. Rich. The water effect. We're going to go for lap number three. The queue's only about 20 minutes again. Why not? We won the other side, got really bad. chilling out not really doing much because uh the keeper wave is huge you don't really want to do anything else but yeah this doesn't seem long at all so we'll wait for this again go number four <laughs> Open these um, toilets. Used to be an old building here. Looks like a new one now. But yeah, that's good. They've got more over this end. So we just had our fourth go today on Gold Rush, and we got uh, the same cycles we did the first two goes. We did it on our third go. We got backwards up the lift hill, but that go just then we went straight up the lift hill forwards first, and then did the lift hill um, backwards afterwards. But yeah, I enjoyed that. It was all right. Uh, I think I still prefer the cycle that we did on number three just because it was a bit more interesting and you feel the forces a bit more, uh, you get a bit more air time as well um, going over the hills backwards so yeah enjoy that and in that um, building there where you stop and you launch where you go backwards it's so noisy. The volume's up really loud but it might actually be too loud because I've heard like kids crying after <laughs> going in that little bit there but yeah I think it's a good addition to the park and you know what the queue moves fairly quickly so this morning we probably waited um, just under an hour for it and then we've only waited about 20 to 25 minutes for our uh, other three goes today so yeah not too bad and we've done some of our other favourite rides here we didn't get to go on the wave because the queue's just been so long all day the one operation service is just not great they need to get another train invest in a new train rate in manner because the queue's literally probably an hour to 90 minutes long and you can, you can see them in the building from the very bottom that's such a long queue i'd only queue from like the top window onwards which would probably be like 20 minutes but yeah so slow getting those out so we didn't do that and we're not done maelstrom we're not done haunting but we've got um gold passes so we'll come quite often anyways uh, but yeah hope you enjoyed the vlog from Drayton Manor gold rush opening day this vlog I guess has mainly been just gold rush opening day but yeah had a good day experience in uh, the UK's newest coaster yeah thanks for watching guys I'll see you in my next vlog which will probably be from my uh, European theme park series which you've already been to so you probably see uh, Wallaby Holland and then uh, my Belvardi vlog coming soon as well so see you guys there thanks for watching goodbye <laughs>